Right, it's a commander cat. The cat goes into the arch position. Let's trade. Yes, it's got a teddy bear in it. Excellent. Right. So, um, if I t now any any of those, so talk trade can no, except for cancel. Talk trade and follow gives you the, the command cursor. So it's silent. It's, my character's not saying what it normally says. Um, right. So it's in follow mode. Let's get it over there. So I've had a, a thought in mind, at Abernathy Farm, there is a cat there, and maybe if I take it to where another cat is, it won't be inclined to run away. See, what I figure is um, Diamond City is an enclosed area, everything else is an enclosed area, but Walden Pond is clear. See how this pans out. Right, well, hello and welcome back to <laughs> my Fallout 4 experience. Yes, we're at Walden Pond. I came here early with the cat somehow, and and, and today, so I'm going to head over to Abernathy Farm from here. Now, I haven't cleared the way. I'm just taking a chance that I can get through the woods without uh, meeting anything too serious. Uh, it'll be interesting to see how the cat handles combat. So, uh, let's get this party started. Yes, it's the same cat. It's got all the stuff it had in it before. follow. Right, get it to go there. Let's see if it's coming. Uh, yep, here it comes. Excellent. Uh, go up here. Oh, it's not too steep for it. Let's have a look. Uh, go there. Let's see it. Um, and there it comes. No, no, it's coming. It's coming. Okay, uh, go there. Where have you gone? No, can't see it. The worst case scenario, losing it in the woods. If you give it a command to go somewhere, it will, and it's in follow mode, it will go there. Um, maybe it's stuck on a rock. Oh, he's behind me. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. So let's walk around. I keep giving it commands. It should. Hang on. Is it? That's it. There it is. Yes. So he went to the place. The last place I said. Excellent. Right. Uh, now we're headed towards the road. Yes. It could be something over there. Let's right, go there. So the cat will stay where I sent it last. I haven't told it to stay there, so it may start wandering off in some direction. It's still there. Oh no, oh, that's a bit of luck. We've got a provisioner. Excellent. This should make things easier. I wonder what the, uh, if any interaction will be. Go there. Excellent, excellent, excellent. This seems to be working out. Go there. Go there. Good. Well, while we make our way up to Abernathy Farm, I can just see in the distance now. There's been a few occurrences which have been unusual. Yeah, so yesterday, when I was making my way back from Sleepwalker's uh, place where I was looking for the cat, uh, an Assaultron appeared out of nowhere and uh, was friendly. Now, I've had Assaultrons attack me in the past and they're normally not friendly. Uh, so, it, this one was friendly and sort of bumped into me in a way that if I'd left my light. Whenever I come across an Assaultron in the field, uh, when I'm attacking the gunners, I normally shut it down and then I destroy it. I don't leave any of them alive because I know what happens if you leave them alive, uh, they come back to the camp and then attack the settlers. 
place. I'm still looking for the cat. I'm on my way back to the car, so I decided to run back instead of uh, just teleporting. And this is where I met the Dominator. Just teleported to the castle. Yeah, rather than run back with this with the assault on, I teleported. You know, when I got here, I was completely alone. There's no cat. So, you know, I just continued on, and then I got halfway across the courtyard, and all of a sudden, bang! It appeared and started attacking. And you know, it's fluctuating between invisible and invisible at the time of the attack, which I don't, I don't think I've seen. I've seen them go invisible and attack, but never fluctuating between visible and invisible. So, I don't know, it might be something to do with the cat. Right, so we've made it to Abernathy Farm. Here's the provisioner. He's got a fully armoured uh, postman's outfit on. Um, yeah, so we'll uh, steer... I don't know, there's a barman stuck in the door. I'll have to uh, steer the cat around the edges. Yeah, Brahmins are always getting stuck in gates, doors. I've even seen them in the house. Like, uh, <laughs> yeah. Right, okay, then where's the cat? Over here. Hello, oh, what we got here? That's another assault on. Hang on a minute. Let's, uh, let's, uh. Well, let's slow this section down. Let's, uh, now, I'm, yeah, the house cat can only inspect the assault on. It can't attack it. Well, that's interesting. Uh, I better not attack it. I better let the uh, settlers and the guns deal with it and try and get the cat around the side, just in case it is after the cat. You never know. The Institute and their evil ways. But why didn't the assault try to attack me? Am I being protected by the cat somehow? So the cat's not phased at all by the, uh, uh, the ensuing battles. It's just calmly, nonchalantly, like a cool cat would, uh, just uh, proceed to each designated point. Right, so we've reached Abernathy Farm. There's Maisie the cat, there's the dog. Let's uh, try and put it over there somewhere. Where is it? It's very hard to see. Uh, oh, look, there it is. Okay, let's get it to uh, inspect Maisie. Right, so it's inspected Maisie. Um, let's see if we can get it comfortable and see where we go from there. If we had a good supply of clean water, things would be pretty good. Huh? Right, sounds like a bit of settler maintenance is required. Let's uh, put the cat somewhere and uh, get on with the, the maintenance. Right, so that's the maintenance done. Uh, let's get back to the cat. Got no reason to trust strangers, so maybe you should be moving along. Hello. Okay, she wants me to move on. That's unusual. Okay. Let's make her. Oh, Maisie can be pacified. Okay, so I put down a sleeping bag. There's 10 people and 10 uh, beds, and now there's 11 beds, and I will tell the cat to sit on it. No, it hasn't done it. Reasons uh, only it knows. Uh, no, it's not really okay. Okay, I was thinking, what do cats like? Um, they like cat baskets. We haven't got any baskets. Uh, they like uh, to sit on like settees, the edge of settees. And I thought, well, there is one object in uh, Fallout 4. It's the ottoman, which I believe is um, a footstool, perhaps. But it's on the first tier of objects. Um, where is it? Oh, that's it there.
Right, so uh, get the cat to go over to the ottoman. Uh, oh, yes, he's gone over to it. He hasn't got onto it, but he's definitely gone over to it. Oh, that's excellent. Okay, so, uh, it likes Ottomans. Now, uh, yeah, stories again. It's wandering off somewhere, it's going somewhere. Let's set it back down here. Can't get onto the Ottomans, so I'll sit it next to it and, uh, because the settlers are starting to act strange. They're saying things like there's a problem, but they're not giving me the option to respond. So I'm going to have to put the cat down for a minute and see what they're going on about. Okay. I hope we can count on the Minutemen to help us. Well, I try to find out, yes, what's up with the uh, settlers. Right, this. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I'll try to see you all again soon. Um, yeah, this is a little bit mystery. Right, uh, bye for now. Minutemen send you to help us?